Looking forward to working out with you. Let's get to work and have some fun. some deep breathing together. Yoga poses are more effective if you combine them with deep breathing. First, watch me. Step onto the Wii balance board. Place both hands on your stomach and spread your feet shoulder width apart. Inhale deeply through your nose. Feel your stomach expand under your hands. Exhale by slowly deflating your stomach. Breathe through your mouth if you find it difficult to breathe through your nose. Repeat several times, breathing at your own pace. When you're ready, gradually increase the time spent exhaling. Are you ready to give it a try? 
Let's do it together. Let's begin. Press up on the control pad to view me from the back. Press down on the control pad to view me from the front. You may find it easier to follow along if you view me from the front. Just mirror my movements. Follow my lead as we do this pose together. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. Try breathing in sync with the blue circle. Inhale as the blue circle shrinks. Exhale as the blue circle expands. You can also inhale through your nose and exhale through your mouth. Just like that. Try to stay still while you continue breathing. Relax your stomach after exhaling to let the air back in naturally. You can also inhale through your nose and exhale through your mouth. Great job! Excellent balance! Deep breathing is good for relaxation and is a fundamental part of yoga. Practice yoga every day to work toward improving your posture. Let's do the half moon pose together. This pose can help stimulate your body and align your spine. I'll do the pose first. Just mirror my movements. Keep your feet planted on the balance board. This will work the muscles from your inner thighs to your stomach. Keep your back and legs straight and your hips tucked in. Expand your chest slightly and relax your shoulders. While you inhale, raise both arms and bring them together at the top. While inhaling, stretch your spine and fingers upward. While exhaling, swing your hips to the left and reach your arms to the right. Without twisting your body, tilt and extend to the side. Hold that position and breathe slowly. Inhale, exhale. While inhaling, Return your upper body to an upright position. As you exhale, swing your hips to the right and reach your arms to the left. Hold that position and breathe slowly. Feel the stretch in your side. Breathe in and slowly return your upper body to an upright position. Exhale and return your arms to your sides, then relax. Are you ready to try it? Let's do it together. Let's begin. Follow my lead as we do this pose together. Breathe in and out slowly as you maintain that pose. Focus on keeping your center of balance stable. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. Great, keep it up. Good, feel your side muscles stretching. Now, return to your original position. Now, let's work on the other side. Breathe in and out slowly as you maintain that pose. 
Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your nose. Don't push yourself too hard. Stretch only as far as you feel comfortable. Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your nose. Now, return to your original position. Well done. Keep at it every day to improve your posture. You've got great flexibility. Stick to your routine and keep stretching just like you've been doing. Doing yoga every day can help align your pelvis and improve your posture. Let's do the warrior pose together. This pose can help tone your thighs and hips and align your pelvis. First, watch me. Just mirror my movements. With your right foot on the balance board, exhale and extend your left leg behind you, taking a wide stance. Make sure your heels are in line with each other. Inhale and extend your arms out to your sides. Exhale and bend your front knee to bring your hips closer to the floor. Tighten your abs and glutes. Push with your back leg. Relax your upper body. Distribute your weight equally between both legs. Focus your eyes on the tips of your fingers. While exhaling, pivot your body forward onto the balance board. Now, let's work on your other side. With your left foot on the balance board, exhale and extend your right leg behind you, taking a wide stance. Make sure your heels are in line with each other. Inhale and extend your arms out to your sides. Exhale and bend your front knee to bring your hips closer to the floor. Tighten your abs and glutes. Push with your back leg. Relax your upper body. Distribute your weight equally between both legs. Focus your eyes on the tips of your fingers. While exhaling, pivot your body forward onto the balance board. Think you're ready? Let's try it together. Let's begin. Follow my lead as we do this pose together. For a bigger challenge, try widening your stance. Slowly breathe in and out. Distribute your weight equally between both legs. Maintain weight in your front leg so that the red bar stays in the blue area. Very stable, well done. Great, keep it up. Now, return to your original position. Now, let's work on your other side. Make sure your heels are in line with each other. got great posture. Doing the warrior pose regularly can tone your thighs and hips. Great, keep it up. 
Very stable. Well done. Now, return to your original position. Great job! Excellent balance! The warrior pose stretches your hip flexors. Do this exercise every day to improve your form and posture. Let's work on the tree pose. This will help build your back and legs. For this pose, you'll balance on one leg. This helps build leg strength. This pose is a great way to stretch your back. I'll show you how to do this pose before we get started. Just mirror my movements. While inhaling, grab your left ankle and place your foot on your right thigh. Once you are stable, Bring your palms together in front of your chest. Raise your hands towards the ceiling. Relax your shoulders so that they are parallel to the floor. Stretch your back and be careful not to let your hips stick out. Inhale and exhale. Hold this position for 30 to 40 seconds. Exhale and lower your arms and leg returning to a standing position. While inhaling, grab your right ankle and place your foot on your left thigh. Once you are stable, bring your palms together in front of your chest. Raise your hands toward the ceiling. Exhale and lower your arms and leg, returning to a standing position. Are you ready to try it yourself? Let's do it together. Let's begin. Watch my movements and do this pose along with me. Breathe slowly as you hold this pose. Focus on holding your balance. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. Visualize your spine stretching. The tree pose stretches your spine and strengthens your back and leg muscles. Exhale and lower your arms and leg, returning to a standing position. Let's move on to the other leg. Breathe slowly as you hold this pose. Inhale through your nose, exhale through your nose. That's right, feel your spine stretching through the pose. Great, keep it up. Exhale. 
Exhale and lower your arms and leg, returning to a standing position. Well done. Keep at it every day to improve your posture. Excellent balance. Doesn't it feel great to stretch your back like that? Keep up your daily yoga training to work toward improving your posture. Let's do the sun salutation together. This pose will tone your arms and thighs. First, watch me do this pose. Stand on the Wii Balance Board. Bring your palms together in front of your chest. Inhale and lift your arms up. From there, extend your reach slightly behind you. While exhaling, bend forward and touch your toes with both hands. Inhale and point your hands at the ceiling. Touch your palms and bend your knees. While exhaling, straighten your knees and bring your arms down. Repeat this movement several times. Are you ready? Let's try it together. Let's begin. Follow my lead as we do this pose together. Focus on holding your balance. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. From there, extend your reach slightly behind you. While exhaling, bend forward and touch your toes with both hands. Reach your arms to the ceiling and bend your knees. Straighten your knees and bring your arms back down to the starting position. The sun salutation can help tone your arms and thighs. From there, extend your reach slightly behind you. While exhaling, bend forward and touch your toes with both hands. Reach your arms to the ceiling and bend your knees. Straighten your knees and bring your arms back down to the starting position. Great! Keep it up! From there, extend your reach slightly behind you. While exhaling, bend forward and touch your toes with both hands. Reach your arms to the ceiling and bend your knees. Straighten your knees and bring your arms back down to the starting position. Great job! Amazing balance! Your form was also impressive. Practice yoga every day to work on improving your posture.
Let's do the standing knee pose together. This pose increases thigh flexibility and helps improve concentration. Before we start, I'll show you how to do this pose. Just mirror my movements. Press your right foot down firmly on the Wii Balance Board. Balance your body and slowly lift your left leg. While inhaling, stretch your spine, focusing on the pose. Exhale and hold your knee, pulling it in toward your chest. Inhale as you relax the pose and exhale as you pull your knee in. Keep your hips and stomach pulled in. Press your left foot down on the balance board. Balance your body and slowly lift your right leg. Are you ready to try this pose? Let's do it together. Let's begin. Follow my lead as we do this pose together. Think about holding your balance as you pull your knee in. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. The standing knee pose helps increase flexibility in your thighs. You've got great posture. Great! Keep it up! Now, return to your original position. Now, let's work on your other leg. The standing knee pose helps increase flexibility in your thighs. Great! Keep it up! Great balance! Can you feel your thighs working? You've got great posture. Now, return to your original position. Well done! Keep at it every day to improve your posture. Excellent balance! Looks like you're making progress with your movement and flexibility. Did you notice that yoga gets more enjoyable as you get better at it? Keep up the hard work! Let's do the palm tree pose together. This pose helps strengthen your ankles and stretch your spine. First, I'll show you how to do this pose. Stand on the Wii Balance Board. While you inhale and exhale, raise your arms up. Raise your heels and stand on your toes, feeling the stretch. Open your arms wide, reaching with your fingertips. Stretch your spine and rotate your arms so your palms are facing up. Hold this pose for 20 to 30 seconds.
Exhale slowly as you lower your arms and heels. Are you ready to try it yourself? Let's do it together. If you don't exercise regularly, your body will need some time to adjust. Follow my movements as we do this pose together. Raise your heels and stand on your toes, feeling the stretch. Breathe slowly as you maintain your pose. Focus on keeping your balance steady. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. Stretching your spine will help stimulate your body. Keep your shoulders wide. Excellent. Really feel your spine stretching. Exhale slowly as you lower your arms and heels. Great job! stability, your form was great too. Keep training like this every day to improve your posture. Let's do the chair pose together. This pose will tone your legs and strengthen your abs. Start by standing on the balance board. Tighten your glutes and abs, stretch your spine, and relax your shoulders. While you inhale, bring your arms up so they are parallel with the floor. While you do this, keep your eyes facing forward. If you can, lift your heels while you do this. Exhale, bend your knees, drop your hips, and tighten your abs. Try to keep your thighs parallel with the floor as much as possible. Keep your back straight and relax your shoulders. Hold this pose for 30 to 40 seconds while continuing to inhale and exhale. Inhale as you come back up, and exhale as you gently lower your arms and heels. Are you ready? Let's try it together. Let's begin. Follow my lead as we do this pose together. Breathe slowly as you maintain that pose. Focus on keeping your balance steady. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. Keep your spine stretched. You're staying nice and balanced. Try your best to hold that pose. Now, return to your original position. Well done! Keep at it every day to improve your posture. Amazing balance! If you want more of a challenge, try raising your heels and pulling your stomach in even more. Practice every day to improve your posture.
Let's do the triangle pose together. The twisting movement in this pose helps you tone your waistline. I'll give you a quick demo on how to do this pose. Just mirror my movements. Put your right foot on the balance board. Now slide your left foot back and take a wide stance. Make sure your left and right heels are aligned. Inhale and open your arms wide. Exhale, twist your body and place your left hand on your right ankle. Raise your right arm straight up and look past your fingertips. Relax your wrists, push into the floor with your fingers and heels. Create separation between your upper and lower body. Keep your hips tucked in. Inhale and exhale. Now, let's work on the other side. Put your left foot on the balance board. Slide your right foot back and take a wide stance. Make sure your left and right heels are aligned. Inhale and open your arms wide. Exhale, twist your body and place your right hand on your left ankle. Raise your left arm straight up and look past your fingertips. Now that you've learned it, let's try it together. Let's begin. Follow along and do this yoga pose with me. Breathe slowly as you maintain your pose. Push firmly with your heels and toes. Put 60% of your weight on your front leg. Put enough weight on your front foot so that you stay within the blue area. Great, keep it up. Great, hold your balance just like that. Now, return to your original position. Now, let's work on the other side. Make sure your left and right heels are aligned. Create separation between your upper and lower body. Keep your hips tucked in. You've got great posture. Great! Hold your balance just like that. Great! Keep it up! Now, return to your original position. Great job! Impressive balance! Good job! Practice yoga a little every day to help improve your posture. Let's do the Downward Facing Dog Pose together. This pose will stretch your back and help increase circulation. Before we start, 
I'll show you how this pose is done. Get on all fours with your hands on the balance board. Exhale and raise your hips up, pressing your heels into the floor. Make sure that your elbows are pointing outward. Pull your knees up and focus on lengthening your arms and legs. Try to push with your arms and point your tailbone toward the ceiling. Place equal weight on your arms and legs. Pull your stomach in and keep your back straight. Keep your eyes on your stomach and relax your neck. Hold this pose for 30 to 40 seconds. Inhale and exhale. Lower your arms and knees and return to your original position. Are you ready to try it yourself? Let's do it together. Let's begin. Get on all fours with your hands on the balance board. Lift your hips as high as you can and straighten your arms and legs. Relax your neck muscles and look down at your stomach. Hold this pose. Place equal weight on your arms and legs. The weight on your hands is being measured. Let's check the results of this test when we're done with this pose. Very stable. Well done. Perfect. Focus on stretching your back. Try to distribute your weight evenly between your hands and feet. Great, keep it up. Try to distribute your weight evenly between your hands and feet. Great, now return to your original position. Well done, keep at it every day to improve your posture. balance. Your form was impressive. Train a little every day to help improve your posture. Let's take a look at the dance pose together. This pose requires good balance and flexibility and strong legs. If you don't feel ready for this yet, practice the other poses for now. In addition to lifting your hips and glutes, this pose helps realign your spine. First, just watch me as I do the pose. Just mirror my movements. Grab the inside arch of your left foot with your left thumb on the sole. Face forward, bring your knees together, and raise your right arm. While inhaling, lower your right arm so it's parallel to the floor. Focus your eyes on the fingertips of your right hand. Exhale and raise your leg using your ab muscles to maintain your balance. Once stable, slowly bend over to a point where you can still breathe easily. Hold this pose. Tighten your glutes and keep your pelvis parallel to the floor. Pulling your hand with your leg stretches your chest muscles. Hold this pose for 20 to 30 seconds. Inhale as you raise your upper body. Exhale as you lower your arms and leg. Next, let's work on the other side. Grab the inside arch of your right foot with your right thumb on the sole. Face forward. Bring your knees together and raise your left arm. While inhaling, lower your left arm so it's parallel to the floor. Focus your eyes on the fingertips of your left hand. Exhale and raise your leg using your ab muscles to maintain your balance. Once stable, 
Slowly bend over to a point where you can still breathe easily. Hold this pose for 20 to 30 seconds. Inhale as you raise your upper body. Exhale as you lower your arms and leg. Are you ready? Let's give it a try. Let's begin. Follow my lead and do this pose along with me. Breathe slowly as you maintain your pose. Hold your balance steady. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. The dance pose can tone your hips and align your spine. Very stable, well done. Now, return to your original position. Next, let's work on the other side. Great job! You've got excellent balance. Great! Keep it up! The dance pose can tone your hips and align your spine. Great job! You've got excellent balance. Now, return to your original position. Great job! Excellent balance! Way to go! Do yoga every day to work to improve your posture. Let's do the Cobra Pose together. This pose will strengthen your back and help improve your posture. Before we start, I'll show you how to do this pose. It's best to do this pose on a soft surface like a yoga mat. Lie face down and place your forearms on the floor. Expand your chest. Press the tops of your feet into the floor and relax your glutes. While inhaling, extend your elbows and lift your upper body. Without using your arms, slowly push your chest out. Don't raise your shoulders. Hold this pose using the muscles in your back and inner thighs. Inhale and exhale. Keep your shoulders relaxed. Breathe naturally and hold this pose for 20 to 30 seconds. While exhaling, slowly bend your elbows and return to your original position. Are you ready to give it a try? Let's go! Let's begin. It's best to do this pose on a soft surface like a yoga mat. Lie face down and place your forearms on the floor. Expand your chest. Press the tops of your feet into the floor and relax your glutes. While inhaling, extend your elbows and lift your upper body. Hold this pose using the muscles in your back and inner thighs. Inhale and exhale. Keep your shoulders relaxed. 
Very stable. Well done. Keep your shoulders relaxed and imagine them opening out to the sides. While exhaling, slowly bend your elbows and return to your original position. Great job! Let's take a look at the bridge pose. This pose will strengthen your core muscles and lift your glutes. First, just watch me. It's best to do this pose on a soft surface like a yoga mat. Lie face up with your knees bent and your feet flat on the floor. Inhale and reach your hands to your heels. Grab your ankles if you can. If you can't, rest your palms on the floor. Exhale and slowly lift your hips. Keep your hands and heels on the floor. Hold this pose for 30 to 40 seconds. Good. Now return to the original position. Now that I've shown you this pose, Let's try it. Let's begin. It's best to do this pose on a soft surface like a yoga mat. Lie face up with your knees bent and your feet flat on the floor. Inhale and reach your hands to your heels. Exhale and slowly lift your hips. Keep your hands and heels on the floor. Hold this pose for 30 to 40 seconds. Very stable, well done. Inhale through your nose, exhale through your nose. Very stable, well done. Good. Now return to the original position. Well done. Keep at it every day to improve your posture. Let's do the spinal twist pose together. This stretching technique stretches your lower back and helps align your pelvis. First, just watch me. It's best to do this pose on a soft surface like a yoga mat. Lie down face up. Inhale and stretch your arms to the side. While exhaling, bend your right knee, cross it over to the left and hold it down. Make sure your foot is pointing to the left just as your knee is. Turn your head to the right. Feel the stretch from your hips through your back. Press your right shoulder blade to the floor and keep it there. Breathe normally and hold this pose for 30 to 40 seconds. Now, twist in the other direction. While exhaling, bend your left knee, cross it over to the right and hold it down. Make sure your foot is pointing to the right just as your knee is. Turn your head to the left. Feel the stretch from your hips through your back. Press your left shoulder blade to the floor and keep it there. Breathe normally and hold this position for 30 to 40 seconds.
Now, return to your original position. Are you ready? Let's give it a try. Let's begin. It's best to do this pose on a soft surface like a yoga mat. Lie down face up, inhale and stretch your arms to the side. While exhaling, bend your right knee, cross it over to the left and hold it down. Make sure your foot is pointing to the left just as your knee is. Turn your head to the right. Feel the stretch from your hips through your back. Press your right shoulder blade to the floor and keep it there. Breathe normally and hold this position for 30 to 40 seconds. This stretching technique stretches your lower back and helps align your pelvis. Really feel the stretch from your hips through your back. Great! Now return to your original position. Now, twist in the other direction. While exhaling, bend your left knee, cross it over to the right and hold it down. Make sure your foot is pointing to the right just as your knee is. Turn your head to the left. Feel the stretch from your hips through your back. Press your left shoulder blade to the floor and keep it there. Breathe normally and hold this position for 30 to 40 seconds. Really feel the stretch from your hips through your back. Very stable, well done. Inhale, exhale. Great, now return to your original position. Well done, keep at it every day to improve your posture. Let's take a look at the shoulder stand pose. This pose strengthens your abs and lower back. It can also help reduce swelling in your legs. Just watch me and I'll show you how to do this pose. It's best to do this pose on a soft surface like a yoga mat. Lie down face up and place your palms on the floor. Inhale and lift both legs, then exhale as you lift your back. Stretch your legs back toward your head. Support your lower back with your hands and pull your chin to your chest. Straighten your body as you raise your legs using your shoulders as support. Once you feel stable, hold the pose for 30 to 40 seconds. Your energy should be flowing up through your toes to the ceiling. Now exhale and lower your legs toward your head. Push your hands into the floor to support yourself as you slowly lower your back. Return your legs to the floor and relax. Are you ready? Let's give it a try. Let's begin. 
It's best to do this pose on a soft surface like a yoga mat. Lie down face up and place your palms on the floor. Inhale and lift both legs, then exhale as you lift your back. Stretch your legs back toward your head. Support your lower back with your hands and pull your chin to your chest. Straighten your body as you raise your legs, using your shoulders as support. Once you feel stable, hold the pose for 30 to 40 seconds. Your energy should be flowing up through your toes to the ceiling. Really lift your hips and tighten your abs. Don't use your neck or shoulders. Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your nose. Now exhale and lower your legs toward your head. Push your hands into the floor to support yourself as you slowly lower your back. Return your legs to the floor and relax. Great job! Let's do some single leg extensions. Before we start, watch me show you how to do this exercise. Just mirror my movements. Raise your left leg and balance on your right leg. Swing your left leg back and raise your left arm up. This exercise will help tone your stomach, hips, and upper arms. Repeat this movement several times. Now let's work the other side. Lift your right leg like this. Use big movements and feel the stretch through your arm and leg. Now that you know how to do this exercise, let's try it. Don't push yourself too hard right off the bat. Try to get used to the exercises first. Raise your left leg and balance on your right leg. Keep your body steady as you stretch your arm and leg. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. That's it, you've got excellent balance. Great, keep it up. Lift your right leg and balance on your left leg. Try counting out loud. One, two, one, two, one, two. That's it, you've got excellent balance. Great, keep it up. Way to go. You've got great stability, good work. 
Keep training with this exercise to maintain good posture. Let's work on the push-up and side plank exercise. I'll give you a quick demo. Place both hands on the balance board and extend your legs. First, we'll do a push-up. If you need to, rest your knees on the floor. Start by bending your elbows. Don't raise your hips too high. Next, we'll move on to the side plank. From the push-up position, cross your feet and reach your arm up. Keep your body straight and neck slightly lowered. Switch sides. Keep your hips aligned when you are facing to the side. Keep your body steady using your shoulder and core muscles. Now that you've learned this exercise, let's do it together. Let's work on building a strong upper body. Place both hands on the Wii Balance Board. Extend your feet behind you. First, we'll do a push-up. Push-up. Right side plank. Now, return to your original position. Push up. Left side plank. Now, return to your original position. Push up. Right side plank. Now, return to your original position. Don't forget to keep breathing while you exercise. Great, keep it up. While you're working out, visualize your ideal body. Have you dropped your hips? Exercise every day to help tone your body. Great, we're all done. Nice work. Train every day to keep toning your body. I'm impressed, you're pretty strong. Once you get used to this exercise, push yourself a little harder and increase the number of repetitions. Let's do some torso twists together. Let me quickly show you how to do this exercise. Just mirror my movements. Step onto the balance board with your arms stretched out. 
First, I'll twist side to side. This exercise works your side abdominal muscles. Next, I'll twist diagonally. Work on twisting your body slowly. Remember, you're twisting, not bending forward. Keep your hips centered under you. Now, change the angle to work on your other side. Now that you've learned this exercise, let's try it together. Let's work on toning those abs. First, we'll twist side to side. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. Work on twisting your body slowly. That's it. Feel those abs working. Great. Now lower your arms for just a moment. Next, we'll twist diagonally. Right. Left. Right. Left. Remember, you're twisting, not bending forward. While you're working out, visualize your ideal body. That was a great workout. Great twists. I'll bet you can feel your muscles working. Train every day and keep aiming for a toned waistline. Let's work on doing some jackknife exercises. First, just watch me. Place both feet on the Wii Balance Board. Lie on your back with both of your arms stretched out. Form a V shape at the first whistle, then lower yourself at the second. Keep your motion steady as you work on your abs. Now that you've learned it, let's try it together. Let's work on toning your ab muscles. Place both feet on the Wii Balance Board. Form a V-shape at the first whistle, then lower yourself at the second. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down, up, down, 
Don't forget to keep breathing while you exercise. Keep at it. Don't give up. That's it. Feel your abs working. Don't give up. That's it. Feel your abs working. Great. Keep it up. Great job. We're all done. That was a great workout. You've got amazing ab strength. Keep it up. Work at this exercise every day to tone your abs. Let's do some lunges together. First, I'll show you how to do this exercise. Just mirror my movements. Stand on the balance board and clasp your fingers behind your head. Move your left leg behind you, like this. Bend your forward knee about 90 degrees, keeping it behind your toes. Make sure your upper body doesn't lean forward or backward. Now let's work on your other leg. Stand on the balance board and clasp your fingers behind your head. Move your right leg behind you, like this. Move slowly, focusing on your thighs and hips. Now that you've learned this exercise, let's try it together. Don't push yourself too hard right off the bat. Try to get used to the exercises first. Step onto the balance board and move your left leg back. The red bar shows the weight you're placing on your foot. Try to push the red bar over the blue line. One. Two. One. Two. Don't forget to keep breathing while you exercise. Is your right leg bent too much? Keep it at about 90 degrees. Good posture starts with a strong lower body that supports your upper body. Step onto the balance board and move your right leg back. One. Two. One. You're doing great. Great. Keep it up. 
Good posture starts with a strong lower body that supports your upper body. That's it. Feel your lower body muscles working. Don't hold your breath or you may raise your blood pressure. Count with me. That was a great workout. Great! You're pretty strong, aren't you? Exercising every day is the first step to good posture. Let's do some rowing squats. First, I'll show you how to do this exercise. Stand on the balance board with your feet shoulder width apart. Swing your hips out and bend your knees slightly, about 120 degrees. At the same time, pull your arms back and your shoulder blades together. This exercise will strengthen your thighs and back muscles. Make sure your knees aren't pressing out past your toes. Now that you've learned it, let's try it together. Let's work on firming up your thighs and back muscles. Try to keep your center of balance within the blue area. Try counting out loud. One. Two. One. Two. One. Two. Great, keep it up. That's it. Feel your thighs and back muscles getting toned. Great. Keep it up. Way to go. Great. You're pretty strong. Once you're used to doing this exercise, try adding more repetitions and push yourself a little harder. Let's do some single leg twists. I'll give you a quick demo on how to do this exercise. Just mirror my movements. Stand on your right leg. Raise your knee up toward your stomach as you twist and touch it with the back of your hand. Don't let your foot touch the floor between lifts. This exercise will give your core muscles a workout. 
Move slowly and focus on stabilizing your abs. Now let's try your other leg. Stand on your left leg. Don't twist too far or you'll strain your lower back. Are you ready? Let's give it a try. Let's work on toning those abs. Stand on your right leg. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. That's it. Feel those abs working. Now stand on your left leg. Try counting out loud. One, two, one, two. Great, you've got excellent balance. Nice work. Train every day to keep toning your body. Those were some great twists. Keep up the hard work. Train every day to tone and strengthen your waistline. Let's work on doing some sideways leg lifts. Here, let me show you how to do this exercise. Just mirror my movements. Stand on your right leg. Lift your leg sideways while raising your arm. This exercise will help strengthen your hip and shoulder muscles. Repeat this motion several times. Now let's switch to the other side. Stand on your left leg. Don't touch the floor between reps. Go slow and focus on your side. Are you ready to go? Let's try some together. Work on toning those hip muscles. Stand on your right leg. Keep your body steady as you lift your arm and leg. Try to keep your center of balance within the yellow area. You're doing great. Nice job, you've got great balance. Now, stand on your left leg. Try counting out loud. One. Two. One. Two. Try not to let your weight shift. 
keep your movement firm and steady. That was a great workout. You've got great stability. Good work. You've got the hang of it. Keep it up. Let's work on the plank exercise together. First, just watch me. Place your forearms on the Wii balance board. Extend your legs back from there. Hold this position. Expand your shoulders to keep your chest raised. Focus on making sure your stomach doesn't drop. If you need to, you can hold the position shown on the right. This exercise works your core muscles. Your core muscles help stabilize your body and maintain your posture. Are you ready? Let's give it a try. Place your forearms on the Wii Balance Board. Extend your legs back. Hold this position. Try to keep your balance and hold the dot steady. Great, keep it up. That's it, focus on working those core muscles. Keep training your core muscles to maintain good posture. 10 seconds left. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, we're all done. Nice work. Train every day to keep toning your body. You've got strong core muscles. I'm impressed. Keep training with this exercise to maintain good posture. Let's work together on the tricep extension. I'll give you a quick demo on how to do this exercise. Hold the Wii remote in your right hand. Remember to wear the wrist strap. Extend your right arm up and support your elbow with your left hand. Bend and straighten your elbow like this. Pay attention to your elbow and keep it steady. Use controlled movements and focus on your triceps. Now, hold the Wii Remote in your left hand. Remember to use the wrist strap. Extend your left arm up and support your elbow with your right hand. Bend and straighten your elbow like this.
Now that you've learned it, let's try it together. Let's work on toning your upper arm muscles. Hold the Wii remote in your right hand. Remember to wear the wrist strap. Press the A button when you're ready. Down, up, down, up, down, up, great, keep it up. That's it, feel your triceps getting toned. This is a great exercise for toning your arms. Great, keep it up. This is a great exercise for toning your arms. Great, keep it up. This exercise is popular because it helps tone your upper arms. Hold the Wii remote in your left hand. Remember to wear the wrist strap. Press the A button when you're ready. Down, up, down, up, down, up, great, keep it up. That's it, feel your triceps getting toned. This is a great exercise for toning your arms. Great, keep it up. Make sure to keep your elbows steady. Keep your back straight to reduce stress on your lower back. Nice work. Train every day to keep toning your body. Once you get used to using the Wii Remote, try increasing the weight. A good starting point could be a bottle of water. Let's work on some arm and leg lifts. First, just watch me. Hold the Wii Remote in your right hand. Remember to wear your wrist strap. With the Wii Remote in your hand, get down on all fours. Holding the Wii Remote, extend your right arm and left leg straight out. Make sure your body is parallel to the floor. Move slowly, focusing on the muscles in your hips and shoulders. Okay, let's move on to the other arm and leg. Hold the Wii Remote in your left hand. Remember to wear your wrist strap. With the Wii Remote in your hand, get down on all fours. Extend your left arm and right leg straight out. Are you ready to give it a try? Let's do it together. Let's do some arm and leg lifts. Hold the Wii Remote in your right hand. Remember to wear your wrist strap. With the Wii Remote in your hand, get down on all fours. Press the A button when you're ready. Extend your arm and leg at the first whistle and return them at the second whistle. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. 
You're doing great. Five more. While you're working out, visualize your ideal body. Really extend yourself. Exercise every day to help tone your body. While you're working out, visualize your ideal body. Good balance. Feel your shoulder and hip muscles working. Now, hold the Wii Remote in your left hand. Remember to wear the wrist strap. With the Wii Remote in your hand, get down on all fours. Press the A button when you're ready. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. You're doing great. Five more. Your arm is dropping, keep it extended forward. You're doing great. Great, keep it up. Exercise every day to help tone your body. You're doing great. Don't give up. Great. Keep it up. Nice work. Train every day to keep toning your body. You've got great balance. Control over your left and right balance is important to maintain good posture. Keep training with this exercise to maintain good balance. Let's do the single arm stand together. I'll give you a quick demo on how to do this exercise. Hold the Wii Remote in your right hand. Remember to wear the wrist strap. Lie face up on the floor with the Wii Remote held above you. Hold your arm perpendicular to the floor at all times. Focus on your abs as you raise up from the floor. From here, push yourself up into a standing position. Don't use momentum. The whole movement should be fluid and deliberate. Okay, next, hold the Wii Remote in your left hand. Remember to use the wrist strap. Lie face up on the floor and hold the Wii Remote above you. Are you ready to try it yourself? Let's do it together. Let's work on improving your overall coordination. Hold the Wii Remote in your right hand Remember to wear the wrist strap. 
Press the A button when you're ready. Keep the Wii Remote raised as you get up and lie down. Lie down. Get up. Lie down. Get up. Exercise every day to help tone your body. Great balance. Feel your thighs and abs getting toned. While you're working out, visualize your ideal body. Now, hold the Wii Remote in your left hand. Remember to wear your wrist strap. Press the A button when you're ready. Lie down. Get up. Lie down. Get up. Don't give up. You're doing great. Don't give up. Your arm is leaning. Keep it pointed straight up. Exercise every day to help tone your body. You're doing great. That was a great workout. Good coordination. Solid left and right balance helps maintain good posture. Use this exercise to work on your overall body coordination. Welcome! This is where you put your strength training to the test. Please place both hands on the Wii Balance Board. Extend your legs behind you. Let's start by doing 10. 1 2 Three, four, come on, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's, that's it for me. You win. That's what I get for underestimating you.
So, you want to test your skills. That's the spirit. Form a V-shape at the first whistle, then lower yourself at the second. Let's start with 10. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. I'm not giving up yet. Down. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. Well done. Now let's do another 10. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. Come on. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Okay, you win. Oh, you're pretty good. You win this one. Welcome. This is where you put your strength training to the test. Extend your legs back from that position. Let's start with 10 seconds. The red dot represents your center of balance. Try to keep your body as steady as possible. Well done. Okay, let's do another 10. <sighs> That's all I've got. That's what I get for underestimating you.
Step on.
You'll get double points if you hit with perfect timing. Give it a try. Right, lock. Left, lock. All right, let's do this together. Right, lock. Left, lock. Right, lock. Left, lock. Come on, fighter. Right, lock. Left, lock. All right, let's do this together. Right, lock. Left, lock. Right, lock. Left, lock. Just like that. Nice block. Here's the next pattern. Right, left, lock. Left, right, lock. All right, let's do this together. Right, left, lock. Left, right, lock. Right, left, lock. Left, right, lock. Keep it up. Here's the next pattern. Left, right, lock. Right, left, lock. All right. Do this together. Left, right, lock. Right, left, lock. Left, right, lock. Right, left, lock. Nice punch. Left, right, lock. Right, left, lock. All right, let's do this together. Left, right. Lock. Right. Left. Lock. Left. Right. Lock. Right. Left. Lock. There. That's it. Nice punch. Here's the next pattern. Right. Left. Right. Lock. Left. Right. Left. Lock. All right. Let's do this together. Right. Left. Right. Lock. Left. Right. Left. Lock, right, left, right, lock, left, right, left, lock. There, that's it. Nice punch. Right, left, right, lock, left, right, left, lock. All right, let's do this together. Right, left, right, lock, left, right, left, lock, right, left, right, lock. Left, right, left, lock. Just like that. There, that's it. Right, left, right, lock. Left, right, left, lock. All right, let's do this together. Right, left, right, lock. Left, right, left, lock. Right, left, right, lock. Left, right, left, lock. Nice punch! There! That's it! Throw your punches any way you want to! Go for a knockout! Great workout!
Let's go. Keep your shoulders back. You've reached 100 steps. As your metabolism improves, your digestive health will too. Move to the rhythm. You've reached 200 steps. Way to keep a steady pace. Four, one, two, three, 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 four, one, two. Three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two. Keep up with me. Two, three, four, one, 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 two. Three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three. You've reached three hundred steps. Move to the rhythm. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Keep your shoulders back. You've reached 400 steps. You're keeping a nice pace.
five minutes left. Keep up with me. You've reached 500 steps. You must be warmed up by now. Four minutes left. Okay, big arm movements. You've reached 600 steps. Way to keep a steady pace. Three minutes left. Keep your shoulders back. You've reached 700 steps. You're going to be tired tonight. Two minutes left. One, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one, two, move to the rhythm. Three, four, one, two, three, four. You've reached 800 steps. You're keeping a nice pace. One minute left. Ten seconds to go. Five, four, three, two, one. 
All done. Welcome back. You're keeping a nice pace. You're keeping a nice pace.
You're keeping a nice pace. Five minutes left. Four minutes left. You're keeping a nice pace. Three minutes left. You're keeping a nice pace. Two minutes left. You're keeping a nice pace.
one minute left. You're keeping a nice pace. Ten seconds to go. Five, four, three, two, one. All done. Yeah. 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 
Begin. And that's the end.